Good afternoon guys, it's a very late start to today's vlog. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to film an entire vlog today because the sun's kind of already setting. But we have come all the way to Abu Dhabi. Um, we were in Dubai this morning. As you know, we've delayed our flight to India for another day. In fact, we may be flying to Pakistan now. I think that's the current plan. Uh, we have also met with JC. He has come from France to join us to help film, which is going to help with the documentary stuff because now, like, it it's, it's going to be a bit more accurately. I don't know. The, the, what we want is that this is a, the journey of me and JP traveling around the world, and it's been difficult so far because either me or JP have been filming other than when we got the GoPros rolling but I think this will be a lot better for the kind of capturing the, the real spirit of what we're doing and uh, and also upping the cinematography game. Anyway we have just arrived at just an insane architectural spec spectacle which is uh, the Grand Mosque in Abu Dhabi. Check this out. This is absolutely insane. So I didn't have the appropriate attire on, so they've given me a, a, a cloak. I don't know what they call these. In, in Morocco, they call these jalabas, but I don't know what they, they're called here. Anyway, I've got my own cloak to cover up my arms and legs. JP was okay, because he, he had trousers and a t-shirt on, so he was... I specifically put this on because I knew about it. He was very respectful. And then I, I, well, I just forgot to tell you guys. Yeah, we, we, we just totally forgot. Wait, I think we've lost JC. <laughs> I don't know what they're making him wear. Mm. Yes, bro! <laughs> <laughs> Oi, we're twins! No, it's good, no? <laughs> <laughs> so good, so good. managed to find a way to the entrance. Like I said before, this is incredibly extravagant. Oh, this is the photo, bro. Oh, check this out. I love how clean it is. Just, it, this is minimalism at, to a whole new level. It's so satisfying. It's like literally squeaky clean. It, it, it reassures me that you appreciate it because it means that we have some connection. Imagine if I was like, nah, I don't like this. <laughs> it's because it's like minimal but also beautiful, like it's yeah. still or ornate and yeah, it's like it, the perfect. It would feel amount. very poor living here. Yeah. Be a little too clutter your mind. I even like things like how the pattern is just on the borders, but then the middle of the floor is just completely white tiles. It's like not too cluttered, but just a little bit. All right, I've just had to take my shoes off to go into the next section. So guys, someone told me that the, the top of these pillars is coated in real gold. And that's pretty impressive because there are a lot of pillars here. Um, this chandelier is is quite something. It's so colourful. All of this is just so so impressive. What do you reckon, JC? It's hard to understand this thing. It's so beautiful. And it's huge. It is huge. I don't think you can realise behind the camera. Yeah. You have to be here to 
yeah, see how small you are compared to this. What I find even more impressive than these big fancy chandeliers is um, if you look behind the chandeliers, there's this incredible like marble carvings on these um, on all these like ceiling panels, wherever they are, and on the dome up there. Look, check that out. It looks just as cool at night. <laughs> <laughs> Back at the hotel. Thank you. Oi, we're doing a we're doing a, a room service party, yeah? Thank you. We're doing a, a room service dinner party. Yeah. Oh I need to hit the You can keep the I need to hit the jacuzzi as well. Oh. Thank you. Whew. Hello. Hello. You've brought us all the food. The food is here. Oh fantastic. Yeah. Thank you. It's time for a dinner party. Would you like to stay and eat with us? <laughs> <laughs> no? I can do it <laughs> Oh wow, this is good. Fantastic. I should have got fries in all honesty. Oh, tea fries. Oh wait, did the falafel come with fries? Yeah. Oh, perfect. Oh, that makes me so happy. Oh, that's a small portion. No. The soup? Yeah. I would your big portion. <laughs> Not very much. <laughs> okay, I, I'm I, was I think this is plenty of food, Louis. <laughs> I was confused. I was confused. Here's the soup. Okay, perfect. Who has the mushroom soup? That's for me. This is the yeah. Oh, is this the mushroom See, one? That's oh, what this you're getting. Getting. This is the linden soup. Yeah, the lentil soup comes with an extra drug, but that's just all. That's, right. <laughs> that's all the mushrooms. Wait, which is which, though? It's a very similar colour, isn't it? So oh, that's mushroom this and that's lentil. This is linden. Okay, perfect. Okay. Nice, nice. Really funny because that's all I have. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, JP's just getting fries and milkshakes. <laughs> you know what's wrong with the Ronin yet? No, uh, I'm gonna check. It's really weird. I really hope it's not completely broken. That suck. Well, today has been a pretty short vlog, but um, it's been important for us to rest up and for JP to do all the intricate planning he's needed to for the next couple of flights. Um, I don't know if I was saying earlier or yesterday, but it's been pretty complicated trying to fly into India. Um, one of the things JP was telling me today is that because there's not many planes that take the fuel that we need, called Avgas, um, in India, it means that they just don't have that fuel anywhere. So some of the airports we wanted to fly into, we can't because we wouldn't be able to refuel. So yeah, quite complicated stuff that I would just never think about. And um, hopefully we've started resolving some of those problems. Um, and like I said earlier, the, the first way that we've solved some of them is actually stopping in Pakistan first, which was something we were planning from the beginning of the trip. And I'm so glad we've managed to make it happen. Um, yeah, I cannot wait for tomorrow. Even though it's a super early start, I'm only gonna get like two hours sleep or something. But um, yeah, I'm really, really pumped. And uh, yeah, I don't know, I think, I think there's a slight worry because um, I've heard Pakistan isn't the safest place, especially certain areas, but I think the area we're going into is pretty chill. I'm hoping we can connect with some of you guys, anyone watching from Pakistan. Obviously these vlogs are super, super behind, but I'm going to do a little Instagram story tonight, see if we can connect with anyone. And uh, hopefully get to explore and connect with and experience some of the culture there. Um, even though we're just, I think we're going to be there for like two days, but it'd be really nice to, to um, yeah, to experience a new country. Uh, this will be somewhere on the trip that I haven't been before. Most of the places I have, but um, yeah, like I said, really pumped. This is going to be great. And it's also great to have JC joining us. Uh, he was getting some awesome shots today. I hope you enjoyed those. Um, he's got the, the 1DX. Most of the stuff we're shooting is on the Sony, but he said, please, can I bring my 1DX? And the, the main advantage of the Canon 1DX is that you can shoot 4K at 60 frames a second, so you can get that smooth, slow-mo, high-quality, 
high res, super high res. So I'm happy about that. And as I was saying, it's gonna bring the extra element and dynamic cinematic um, element to, to the documentary. He's um, very talented. I'm gonna link his stuff below, you can check him out. And uh, yeah, it's good to have him part of the team for the next couple of weeks. So, these, those guys are asleep. I'm gonna go and grab some sleep as well and we will see you very, very early in the morning. Peace out, enjoy life, and live the adventure. Boom. Thank you.